Yo, what is up YouTube? In today's video, we're going to be creating color codes. So, I've already made the scripts, obviously. If you want to get the scripts, well, if you're watching this video, then obviously you do. So join the Discord, linked in the description. Um, and we'll have a Unity package, and you basically just import it, and then it'll go into scripts, computers, new color, and then you'll get these two scripts. So, as you can see, color codes work right here, 059. So what you want to do, to get started, you want to create a empty game object, name it whatever you want, drag in the color manager main script onto it, keep these at 111, current color, leave that as uh, black, then the red value, green value, and blue value, you just want to add, I'll tell you how to do that in a second, but the offline player skin, this is for offline color codes, because I don't know if you've seen but I was not connected to a room and the color codes worked. So what you want to do is you want to just drag in your like skin to mesh renderer. So your, 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 this thing, your actual mesh of the thing. It has to be a skin mesh renderer. If it isn't, I'm sorry, it won't work. You can edit it in the code if you want, but you know, anyway. What you want to do then after you've done that, let me just do this, 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 this. There we go. Now you want to add three texts red text, green text, blue text. And the way I get the spacing correct is I just do this and then with a nine, and then you create three of them and then you space them out correctly under each other. You just wanna drag them into these. So red value text, like I said, just that. And then what you wanna do now is on your numbers. So I've got options for different colors. Um, what you wanna do is on number one, set it as 1.1 because you always want to keep it as one here with a point something um, because the way that we do it is we're using math in the code which does it weirdly but anyway with number zero it's just zero um, so what you do is number one 1.1 number two 1.2 1.3 1.4 1.5 1.6 1.7 1.8 1.9 as you can see just like that um, then you can add multiple so you the tag, for me it's finger collider, you can adjust that to whatever you want. Uh, for the color button type, change that for your different things. So these are my red, so set that as red. Um, and then whenever you're in, you can test it. And like I said, it should adjust this. If it for some reason adjusts your face or your body fur, make sure on your, your, your chimp model here, or whatever yours is, the fur, is first. So this fur here, oh, I mean last, wait. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I'm confused now. <laughs> so it adjusts this one. So it should do it on its own. If you don't want to adjust it, you can open up the code and then in here, I know you don't know how, uh, you guys, ugh, my English ain't working today, guys, sorry. So right here, you might want to change it so it actually sets the material name instead of doing it as in the skin mesh renderer. But anyway, um, that should get set up. If you guys have any questions, leave it in the comments below. Um, and make sure you guys like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next one. Bye.